Lamar, can you take us through your performance today? Kind of how you felt? Uh, well, you know, I, um, I felt good, you know, going into the game. I felt our coach was doing a great job, you know, um, game planning for the game. And we were focused this week, and we executed. Lamar, do you like connecting with Dez, or does he just happen to be the guy open that you see first? I like to get connected with any one of my receivers, you know. Whoever's going to touch down, you know, whoever get open. And Dez just happens to always get open, so, yeah. What do you think of, uh, I was watching from the sideline, what do you think of uh, Puma's performance today? Keep telling y'all this. I've been <laughs> telling y'all about him since, since summer during camp. You know, um, Puma's he a, he a great player. You know, he, he go through his reads and stuff like that. He can spin the ball. You know, he, he's a smart quarterback. I love him out there. You know, I'm always cheering. I know y'all see me. <laughs> I cheer more than the cheerleaders. When he's out on the field and you're watching him, do you give him feedback when he comes back, tell him what you saw? Or? Uh, you know, it depends. You know, um, if, if I feel like he needs help or something, but, you know, he, he's been good so far. So, you know, I don't say nothing to him, just let him play his game. You were right about him. You got any more, any more secrets for us? Any, anything else we should be looking for? Got to keep him secret. <laughs> <laughs> Coach well, said that you were really trying to have you had as much as 350 yards of offense. Uh, seemed easy. Kind of talk about it the first half. And you said we're prepared today. And look, it's, yeah. It seemed like it came easy today. Oh, uh, well, you know, our line did a great job. You know, um, our front five did a great job today. I don't think I got sacked at all. Uh, our running backs were running the ball hard. Our receivers was getting open, and we just executed. Uh, my offense, I feel today, did a great job overall. And we got Stan Bay right here. He's cool, so, yeah. Speaking of the running backs, Coach said the last couple of games he's been trying to emphasize the run a little bit more in the offense. Just being behind center, how do you see that progressing? <laughs> Um, it's looking good. You know, um, our line been driving people back. Um, their defense on um, the line. I just feel it's doing. It's looking good so far. So, yeah. Charles, four catches, including the, the touchdown you referred to. Do you feel like you're starting to get more and more involved in the passing game? Uh, yeah. Uh, I mean, whatever play coach call for the tight end. You know, uh, if I'm in, you know, I, I'm. You know, I know Lamar is trying to get me the ball, so I'm trying my best to get open every time. Uh, my number is called because I know Lamar is going to be looking for me to catch the ball. Lamar, did you was it tough? How tough was it going into this game with everything that happened around campus this week? Uh, week I guess leading into today. Oh, uh, you know, we just you know that it was tough. You know, but we you know we just focused on us. You know, we you know we had a great um, game coming up Saturday, um, and we needed to win for our fans. You know, just a community in the city of Louisville. Can you feel the community sort of reeling a little bit as you guys went through the week? Uh, yeah, you know, um, we were sitting online and stuff like that. You know, they tagging us in posts. And, you know, they just want to see our, um, our programs um, succeed. And we just try to execute for them. Anything else? Anything for John? Bernard? A couple more tackles for loss today. You're getting up there in the national ranks. Uh, how do you keep yourself humble while, while you're starting to make a name for yourself? Uh, really, man, I don't really. I try not to pay attention to that stuff. You know, I mean, it's. I mean, I just do. I, I, when I get on the field, I try to make most tackles and most plays that I can. You know, to make the team better, so we can get the ball in Lamar's hands. So, I mean, stats. I mean, I see them, but I mean, I don't really think too much about. it. I just play football at the end of the day. Now, you yeah. guys only gave up 80 yards of total offense today. You guys mentioned that you want to get to the locker room afterwards? Uh, I mean, when stuff like that happens, I mean, that's what we're used to having, you know, even from last year and the years before, we've always had top defenses. So we're just basically trying to get back to that. And when we got players to do it and all that at this point, just execute. What's the recovery process like when you guys got a short week? How do you kind of like speed up the recovery from getting kind of nicked and bumped? In a uh, it, it comes with it, you know. I mean, you play these games, you play, what, three games in 12 days? So, you know, that's. That's a tough thing to do, but just get back on the horse and keep going. You know, that's the part of it. We signed up for it. So um, they're going to be working too. I mean, they're in the same situation as us. So we're just going to go out there and uh, practice the same way we do and uh, go through uh, all of our pregame stuff the same way we do each week. What kind of – what the performances like this against teams like Murray um, do for you guys moving forward against a team with the caliber of North Carolina State is more or less the first uh, marquee game you're all going to have since Clemson? Uh, it's definitely a confidence builder. You know, when we going against uh, these guys, I mean, not taking credit away from them too. Um, just 
seeing that stuff is actually can be ran right, you know, executing his main thing with these game with these type of games, these past two games, is mainly executing. So we try to um, definitely just keep playing our game and don't change anything up and that's what we're not gonna do. I mean, we're gonna change we're not gonna change anything up for NC State either. So um, definitely a good uh, confidence booster for us. When when you've had the sacks and the tackles for a loss this year and uh, improving from last year, what's what's gone right? Is it a strength thing? Is it a, a scheme thing? Um, mainly just watching more film. I mean, I watched a lot of film last year, but this year I really watched a lot of film. Like I watched film on everybody that we play and going to play. So just mainly film work and then definitely being getting stronger and faster uh, in the weight room and stuff like that. That definitely helps out a lot and makes it my job a lot easier.